air ride, carbon, Alcantara on everything, leather interior, banging hi-fi, absolutely awesome road presence. But you live on a farm and you live in Dorset, which means you've got really bad roads. Actually, I think anyone in England here can relate to bad roads. So you live in England. What are we going to do? An all out sports fan is just not going to cut the mustard. But you really like that. So we've invented the TTX Carbon, which is that. And I secretly bloody love this thing. Come and have a look at this. Carbon fibre arches, not tucking tyres anywhere. Air ride, but uppy, not downy. So we've got a very different air ride system in here. Super comfortable, really, really durable, and uh, brilliant for smashing down a green lane. Carbon fibre front end. Oh, it's got a centre strut on it. This is a new addition. Um, I like it, it's cool. I wasn't expecting that there, but hey man, it's Van Haven, always up for, for surprises. This is the ultimate SUV alternative because it does everything that a normal 4x4 should do, but it just offers you a load more and a load more of everything, space, Viability when purchasing it, because they're normally the same sort of money as a big SUV. Street cred, road presence. It's got a bigger roof rack than pretty much everything. It's got the world's lightest light bar on there, which is very light and very bright. And um, absolute luxury. So I must explain. This van's a year old. And this van has been used as a media vehicle for the last year or so. And um, it's been a fantastic bit of kit for the team. They can have their computers in here. We've got more batteries and habitation electrics than you could ever possibly need. We've got swivelly front seats. We've got the big Ovano system at the back so you can put all your camera gear and whatnot. And the gentleman who's bought this, William, will, it's from a media company and it's going to really help him to uh, have an easy life on set. And yes, it's got 240 power off grid so you can have a coffee machine because it seems that everyone wants a coffee machine at the moment. So awesome. The TTX Carbon. Does it have a place on the UK roads as a full bore modified transporter? I think it does. But I'm putting that question to you guys. You're the transport community and we want to hear your opinion. And if so, what more can we do to it? I quite like the idea of ball bars and like some big shackles and stuff just because they're about ball bars and shackles. Who doesn't want ball bars and shackles on their big 4x4 type van? This is the demo van that we did a video on last week and it's really nice, watch that video and uh, let us know if you think it's really nice. Um, essentially, these are exactly the same, they just tick all the boxes. It's got all the beautiful interior, it's got all the carbon, it's got the air ride, it's got the cool wheels, it's got all the big hi-fi in it, um, but so does that. And there is a place for this. If you're the sort of family or the sort of business that needs to have a really big, really gnarly, vehicle to get down your big track or go off road somewhere or just go somewhere where you want to put your mountain bike in the back and you really should not be going with your transporter the TTXC is a wicked bit of kit and I reckon we're going to be seeing an awful lot more of these 
over and out. I'm going to go and do some emails and have another coffee.